<laughs> right then, let's begin. So, <laughs> oh, Baka, no, one bar of connection. <laughs> Gee, thanks GG Project Red for the Wither ad. Wait, the, wh what ad? Also, oh, Wither, Witcher. Wait, advertisements? I have to, I have to disable them. My... Oh no, wait, yeah. So, twi so Twitch is forcing me to at least have a 15 second or 30 second advertisement, or else I'm not allowed to be affiliate. Yes, fun, right? Fun, right? Anyways, welcome back to Minecraft. <coughs> Fun. Yeah, and, uh, sorry man, <laughs> that's a price, that's a price I have to pay. <laughs> welcome back to Minecraft, welcome back to uh, the Sumsino, or Kas Kasum Kasumino, Kasu Casino. So basically, um, this was something that I wanted to do for a long time, and I wanted to see if I can make like a, a just a completely evil casino in Minecraft. I know that a lot of people have made a casino in Minecraft in normal mode, or like the overworld, and I was like, hell yeah, let's make one in the nether. <laughs> oh boy, this is going to end badly. And <laughs> I have been working on this for a while, and let's see here. So this bastion, let me make the ar armor that you lost. It's going to take a while. Time to gamble, hell yeah, with our lives. So... <laughs> Also, welcome Luna, uh, and also Gure. Um, so, uh-oh, these things are still... Ah! Go away! Bacon man. So, <laughs> we did some preparation here, and we already made a big part of all of this. Um, mean piggies, yeah, the, those, I hate those enemies. Even though today we're going to exploit the pigs, okay? Today we're going to make use of the piglins. Also, am I already lost in my own the casino? Withered, I can't get out! <laughs> or I have a capitalism, yeah! Okay, hold on, get in there. So, I... Uh, <laughs> first thing I did... Was make the game's largest nether portal. <laughs> These were dancing girls. Hey, wait, 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 what do you think I'm here for? Also, nose, welcome. I'll actually look it up. I was like, wait. Because the thing is, like, if you make a casino, you want the entrance to be grand, right? Oh. So I... <laughs> look at this thing. And the, here's the worst part, right? If you go through it, if you go... Ow, 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 no! Also, I lost all my equipment from the last stream, so I'm kind of back on, like, broke. I was born in Las Vegas. I'm good at gambling, not... Wait, wait you were really born in Las Vegas? Also, welcome, Chia. So if you go through this... Gold... <laughs> Shitty gold armor, I like it. You get shit out here. Like, I, I really expected to, like, see a giant nether portal in the overworld, but no, you just get a small one. Also, cat? Are you my cat? Get in there. Later. <laughs> I have no idea where I am. But, oh well. So, this is kind of like the... <laughs> the entrance... To the fucking casino? He is now. Exactly. Welcome, cat. There he is. And even though this is like... It, it was a bastion. This is the first bastion we discovered in Luna's server. And this thing has been a pain in the dick for a while. Because we were like, okay, what do we do with it? Because it's just in the way. It's full of enemies. And I was like, hey, let's recycle it. Let's just refurbish it and turn it into a casino. So that's what we did. So me and Wither have been spending some time here. Um, time to, you know, make something out of this. And we were like, hey, I have some goals set for this. My god fishing rod. Oh, you can you could you can get one easily. Come on, Baka. So also Baka, if you wanna If you wanna come here to the casino, uh I wanna see if you can participate in my favorite game of all, Antarctic Roulette. Because that's currently the only one that I set up, because that was a complete pain in the ass to make. Uh, the others I'm gonna wanna make on stream, because that's way more fun. Especially the gacha, which was gonna be right here. So um, so if you watched that, also, mm -hmm. I know right now it's a very inconvenient time. I'm still trying to figure out what is like a good time to stream on a Friday. Because I kind of have, um, I kind of figured out that if I, w I so I want to make like a standard streaming schedule, right? Uh, for me, it's impossible to stream on a Monday. And I want to see if I can choose between Thursday and Friday. 
Because Tuesday is a must stream day, and so is Saturday. Mm -hmm. yeah. So for me, it's four or five days in the week that I can stream. And Friday mm -hmm. is a very evil day to stream, mainly because, uh, you know, everybody has weekend, of course, and most people are off of work really early, and there's a lot of people streaming on a Friday. So for me, it's still very conflicting to see, like, on what day on Friday I want to stream. But I'll, I, I think I'll figure it out. Mm -hmm. And if not, then A! Also, there's not a cat here called Catsino. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, one day I'll get off my cat addiction. Anyways, th th these are here to die. But I set up one game, and that's over here, the Antarctic Roulette. And this is a bit... Well, so first of all, Russian Roulette is banned on Twitch. You cannot have Russian Roulette... In you okay? I always like to see satisfying customers. You can always alternate for a few weeks, see what day works better. Yes, that's true, that's true, that's true. Because, like, for me, Monday is impossible. I can't stream on Monday. And... Uh, between Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, it's like... I'm not sure. But, like, Tuesday is a must, so is Saturday, and Sunday... Eh, depends on, like, what I have planned. What do you want, Galt? Here you go. He gave me two nether bricks? You rip off. What the hell, man? Mm -hmm. These customers suck. So... Antonic Roulette. So this is the way we set it up. It took a while uh, for me and Weta to do all of this. But at first we had eight dispensers. And you basically, if you know... Uh, if you know how Russian Roulette works, uh, there's a 1 in 6 chance of you dying brutally. And... <laughs> we made a trailer, right? We made a trailer for this. And I... Hey! Get out of here! And in the trailer, uh, it was a complete sketch. As in, like, it was, you know, completely acted and all that. Except for the last, like, five seconds, I didn't expect to get annihilated that quickly. Because apparently there's two things in the nether that are inconvenient. So... Ow! Hey! No! Oh. Okay. It was a great trailer. It was. It was. And the thing is, I, I really like to make these trailers for every Minecraft uh, stream. But what I didn't realize is that, like... Okay, so this is what we did, right? We filled it with this. These are, like, the bullets of the Russian roulette chamber. Antarctic roulette chamber. Twitch don't ban me. And if you get a water bucket, you survive. Alright? You, like... That's it. Because then the, whole, then the thing goes poof. If you get lava, you're dead. Because then lava floods the entire chamber and you're completely gone. Two things I didn't realize. I really thought in a trailer I would survive at least the first bullet to so, to show that it, that it would like shoot out like, and then and then it was like Wither's turn, and then it was my turn mm -hmm. again. So it would be like a one minute, uh, trailer, right? It was a forty second trailer because I died in the first bullet. I stepped on the switch and I was like, "Are you kidding me?" Like it, I immediately immediately got to one in six, and I got annihilated. Mm. <laughs> and. The worst part is, after the, after shooting the trailer, I was like, Withered, what the hell happened? And Withered told me, oh yeah, so lava flows quicker in the nether than in the overworld. And I was like, oh. So basically, if you lose at Russian Roulette, oh sorry, Antarctic Roulette, you're gone. Also, Stenhawk, <laughs> welcome. So, that is one of the two things I prepared here. Uh, gacha is what we have prepared. Um, then here are the slot machines. And I think I kind of need Luna's or Modbus help with this one. Because I kind of want to make a joke here. So slot machines, I want to fill it with gold. And I want to fill it with silver. And now you're like, hey, Sumio, there's no silver in Minecraft. Yes, there is. There is an enemy called the Silverfish. And the Silverfish is the most annoying enemy in the game. And what I want to do is I want to fill the slot machines with gold and silver. However, that means <laughs> that if you roll this and you don't get gold, you get assaulted by Silverfish. Which are excruciatingly evil enemies. And the other thing we wanted to do is if you can see if you can catch a guest uh, through the nether portal, which might be possible, <laughs> but it's going to be a difficult one. And finally, finally, of course, the only proper way to end the stream is with the complete destruction of the casino. And you might be like, Sumio, do you have like a bunch of TNT prepared? No.
listen, at the very end of the stream, there might be a very angry customer, okay? A very angry customer that wants to kill the manager. And uh, this is why I'm asking, hey, Withers, do you want to get promoted to manager? Because I might be getting the fuck out of this place very soon. So, Sue, you remember what happened last time? No. I did give you a shit on of nether skulls. Exactly, we gotta put those to good use. <laughs> I will regret this because I have gold armor and not netherite. So, I am going to... <laughs> listen. Listen, we might need to have Pitch and Syncraft in here very soon to get rid of that. Wait, since when we, well, well, I can see my employee. Uh, wait, when you, when we made this withered, come on, we gotta go up to the. T Where's the casino? Oh, okay, okay, baka baka. Uh, how would you come to the casino and you wanna play a fun game of Antarctic Roulette? <clears throat> yeah, well, okay, but this thing, this time, it's only one wither, okay, only one, and not four. Hey! Yeah. Also, I'm currently the only person in the entire server that has a trident. So yeah. And and in the th third day of Christmas. Oh, which by the way, I'm gonna make a bunch of uh, videos because um, during Le Luna's celebration stream, there was a comedian that made a bunch of videos about the twelve days of Christmas, and I was like, oh hell yeah, I am. Lip casting those. <laughs> so, on the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me herpes. So, that's gonna be fun. <laughs> but that's once again a lot of editing. Enemy sighted, yeah, everywhere. Okay, so, uh, Baka. Noise. <laughs> I actually saved all 12 of those. I'm like, oh, hell yeah. That's fucking TikTok gold. Sumio, why do you care about TikTok? I. Okay, so here's the thing about TikTok, right? So, I noticed that a lot of VTubers, uh, especially members of Team Starstruck, have a lot of success on uh, TikTok, and I was like, oh, that's cool. There's one thing I realized about TikTok, because I had one video go trending in my country, and I was like, what? And I noticed during the st statistics, and the likes, and the comments, that it was all 100% from my own country. And I was like, oh. Nobody wants to care about TikTok, but it is really useful. I hate it though, I hate it. And I want to show you a video about why I hate TikTok. Um, if I can still find it. It's a piece of shit. Let's see if I can still have it. Uh... It's a video I found today that is that kind of like disgusts me a lot. Yeah, this one. This one. So, video time? Oh, we could do that, we could do that. Uh, it's not really a fun video, but it but this video kind of sh kind of displays very well about how much I hate TikTok. Uh, see if I can like put the thing in. No, I cannot. Uh, window capture, I think. Mm. Actually, I'll just link it. I'll just link it. Fuck it. Here. So, so apparently people of like age 14 to age, uh, I don't know, 16 think it's funny to, you know, have animal abuse as a way to gain likes on TikTok. And, yeah, that's fun. I, 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 imagine, imagine putting your fucking cat on glued paper. To make a silly dance so you can get TikTok likes. Fuck you. Fuck TikTok, okay? It's useful, but I fucking hate the website. And I hate the fact that people can actually go to such ends for it. It's kind of funny. Imagine how the cat feels like, Baka. Imagine how the cat feels like. How dare the poor cat. I... Come on, get a high crime. Like, come on. Like... Th th that's glued paper. That's fucking glued paper right there. Also, welcome Okami David. They're having this German Shepherd sniff your crotch at all the time. I... Excuse me? Uh, okay. Well. Anyways, Baka. Okay, so here's a, f here's a fun thing that we're gonna do in the first part of the stream, okay? How about the three of us... Uh, I'm gonna do a game of Antarctic Roulette. So let's see which of us three is going to survive and which one of us three is going to meet the fiery end. 
All right. So if you if you guys could come over here, uh, wait, where are you? Where'd you both go? What you do with your crowd, Chewbacca? I. <laughs> okay, never mind. Hey, Stanhawk, do you wanna do you wanna come over here to the Nether? <laughs> actually, actually, I think. Stenhawk, do you know where the nether portal is? Because if so, then uh, how about the four of us play a game of Antarctic Roulette? But yeah, like 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 TikTok, it's a website that disgusts me. Especially since children often have no limit to their own sense of hilarity, you know? Is there storage? Yes, there is. Yes, there is. So right before you enter uh, the Antarctic Roulette, there's a chest right here. You can, you can put all your stuff in. That's the idea. That's the idea. And, well, if you die, you don't lose all, all your shit. So, you know. And of course... Okay, nice. Because then we can do some Antarctic Roulette. Baka might not participate. <laughs> and oh boy. Because there's a lot of things in the nether that we still need to do and check out. So that's gonna take a while. Uh, but yeah, like... like and the thing is that, like, this is a video that, that that was on my live feed, right? That was on my live feed. And I was like, ah. Uh. And what sucks about TikTok is that, like, um, I saw a lot of YouTubers, uh, you know, Metal Team Stars, like, they had a lot of success with that. And I was like, hell yeah, I'm gonna go on TikTok as well. But that that's when I realized, TikTok always localizes your videos. So if you post a video, it will only be centered in your region. So for me, if I post a video on TikTok, it will always default to the Netherlands. Always. And that fucking blows. Because here's the thing, Dutch people don't care about VTubers. They don't care about anime. But I but I guess they do care about Minecraft. So, alright. So for me, it might end up not working out very well. Really? Yep. Yep. Not Antarica? I didn't know that. <laughs> not Antarica. <laughs> <laughs> Zero viewers forever. Well, at least I'm the greatest TikToker in Antarctica, and I, I don't want that title. But yeah, yeah, that's what it does. So the thing is, I actually looked at these the statistics for my trader video that uh, that went trending in the Netherlands for like an hour. And it was 100% Dutch viewers, Dutch likes, and Dutch comments. And I was like, oh. Huh. And I was like, alright, well, that's weird. But apparently TikTok localizes all your videos. So for you, Luna, it would mean that, you know, it's centralized to, I assume, the USA or USA Central or USA West Coast. Uh, because the thing is, Luna, you can actually check that out. Like, for example, did did you did you see any comments or likes from, like, non-Americans? Because for me, it was 100% Dutch, and that's not good. Because Dutch people, well, most of them don't care about speaking English. They do not care about VTubers. They do not care about streamers, but I guess they do. They, they like Minecraft, sure. Also, Stenhawk, uh, how about I pick you up? How about I pick you up and bring you to my casino? Uh, or, even better, how about I bring you to the main entrance? Which is uh, this monstrosity right here. <laughs> yep. I didn't notice really. All it comes with English, so we had to say without digging deeper. Yeah, it is, it is. It, actually, I think it would be a task for Modbot to see, like, the TikTok statistics. Because I think that he has a way to do it. Um, but yeah, as, as far as I'm aware... Um, it's complete... Whoa! Hey, Baka. So, Stenhawk, uh, can you head over to this location? There you go. That is the main entrance. I gotta go to the store, be right back. 44, 44 degrees Celsius outside? Something is going horribly wrong in Mexico at the moment. 44 Celsius, dude! That is nasty hot weather. Alright. The Australian skeleton is very vicious. It attacks on sight. It's a nasty predator without any natural enemies. Ooh! Okay, never mind. I'm getting out of here. Ugh. No, 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 no! No! Okay. Oh! I forgot how dangerous this place is. Oh! Okay. Customer. Come here, friend. Let's go to the casino. 
I wonder if we can get this guy into the Antarctic chamber. Come here. How about we... Uh, <laughs> watch this guy walk into the fucking Russian roulette chamber and survive all bullets. I, I will lose my shit. Okay. <laughs> Welcome, customer. <laughs> Well, while we're waiting for Stenok and Baka to uh, show up. Oh my god. This <laughs> fucking zombie. Okay. Uh. <laughs> he's, he's, he's too tall. Contestant number one. Please. Oh my god. Please enter. <laughs> also, Gure, welcome back. Welcome. Alright. Let's go play Antarctic Roulette. Now, here's the thing, though. Uh, I don't know if I can... Uh-oh. Ow! Can he activate uh, the, the switch, though? Alright! Contestant, step on the switch! Okay, what if we stand like right above it right here? Maybe then he can activate it? With it, can you see if you can lure him over to the uh, to the pet right there? Or maybe he's stuck in here now. <laughs> oh wait, maybe if you like... Maybe you place like one block right there. Our contestant doesn't know what to do. I guess he he's not in the winning mood right now. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Contestant number one got water for the first shot. There we go. All right. Let's, let's do it again. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Let's let's see if our contestant can survive all the bullets. Okay, hold on. Okay, I think if I go to the door, he might activate it again. Here I am. Here I am. Oh oh oh! No! <laughs> Why always me? <laughs> Why? Ah, ah, ah. No, it, it the fibers in the nether. Oh, <laughs> shit. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. <laughs> Holy shit. You and your health are clutches. <laughs> God damn it. Luna, thank you. Thank you for the... It was at this moment. Gold? <laughs> and he knew he fucked up. That was perfect. <laughs> also... <laughs> thank you, Gure, for the gold. Uh, oh, right, 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 right. Okay, so one more announcement about the sound bits. Um, I ho Hopefully tomorrow, uh, I will replace the 20-bit meow um, with a new voice line, which is going to be... Uh, the voice line that actually made me laugh my ass off during the cooking stream Which was, THESE MOTHERFUCKERS are EATING MY CORN! And I have that one clipped And I wanna see if I can integrate it into sound clips Yeah, that one, that one So I wanna replace Meow um, <laughs> With THESE MOTHERFUCKERS are EATING MY CORN! Cause That actually cracked me the fuck up Also weird, how is it possible that like the moment he's alone in the chamber It's water and the moment I enter it's lava Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> what are the odds of that? <laughs> okay, this is rigged. This is rigged. Why every single time I am in the chamber, lava? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me just let me just deposit all my stuff here. Gold, gold, gold. All right. This is absolute bullcrap. Okay, I want to see. Where it is currently set up, right? We would probably set it up that way. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Wait, are you rigging it? Nice. Hey. Casino underground, right? Oh, Wither, no. Okay, come on. All five bullets. All five bullets. I can survive. Yes. Yes. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can survive all. Okay. <sighs> Let's go. Oh, yes. Yes, one more. Okay. Here we go, Wither. 50-50. 50-50. They call me the luckiest man, Antarica. Ah!
How does he do it? How does he do it? Okay, well, the 100% might be a bit too much! Ah! Uh, oh my gold! <gasps> no, my armor! I forgot to take it off! <sighs> I forgot to take off my armor. Okay, whoops. <laughs> Janitor! Clean up and I'll... <laughs> Shit. <laughs> what did you expect? <laughs> Fuck, man! That goes to loot. <laughs> no, my god. <laughs> yes. Okay, hold on. Let, let me just make some gold armor real quick and then, and then bring Stenhawk in. So, I, okay, between the four of us, I want to see which one of us can, can survive the Antonic Roulette. Okay? And the winner gets, um... Well, I don't know, Gout. It's most valuable for me, at least. God, that looks fucking snazzy. Alright. Back in the block. Alright. What did you expect? Well, I, I... I was prepared to die there, because the thing is, Chia, once you're in, there's no escape unless someone opens the door on the, on, on the other side. So... Yep, dip. So, okay. So that's the first thing I want to do here, uh, the roulette, and then we want to make the gacha machine. So the thing is, long ago I wanted to try to make a gacha machine, and I failed. Because, well, it's hard. Because you need to like trap a piglin in a cage, basically. And according to Wither, that's actually really easy, but I'm like, no, that's really fucking hard. So... <laughs> hey! Man, I can't believe this. Oh, hey, piglin, piglin. Can I lure him? Hey, friend, come. Oh shit! Ooh. Come here, enter my casino. <laughs> I don't think it works. I think you need like melee piglins. All right. So, Stenhawk, uh, have you made it to the nether yet, or... Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. oh Baka has. Baka, Baka, you're getting attacked by a piggy! Oh. Hey, Baka, you might want to kill this thing before it kills you. I'm in the nether. Okay. So, Stenhawk, can you go to these coordinates? 200... 124x... Uh... 188c. There you go. Oh, we have a contestant right here. Okay, 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 guys, guys, guys. We, we have, okay, let's see if we can trap this guy. Let's see if we, if we can trap this piglin right here. Ow! Hey, come on. Hold on. Move. Over there. Ow. Come in, stand here, stand here. Yeah. Good. Yes! <laughs> Withered, we did it. We got a gacha machine. Nice. Now you can't escape. I think. Wait, do we need to like, make something here to like go on top of it? <laughs> yes! We did it. We got a gacha machine. Mm. Except he keeps giving me nether brick. I don't want that. So where's my stuff? Hold on. Gold, gold, gold. Uh, I think that's all I need for now. So, like, does he have a cooldown? Like, how many how many times can you like get shit to him? Oh. <laughs> I don't want that. He got withered. Dirt. Come on. Crying obsidian. Hey, that's that, that's pretty good. So, why am I calling this gacha? Because apparently there's a mechanic in this game that if you give gold to a piglin, it will give you something random in return. A present. Yes. Stan was slain by a piglin. Uh oh. Uh, Stanhawk. Well, we still have to wait for Stanhawk to return. So, he gave me string. So the thing is with gacha, right? You basically deposit money and you get something in return. And there's like a, let's say, 90% chance that it's complete garbage. 
but I know, I know for a fact that like big wins, they can give you like a 1% chance of giving you an enchantment, enchantment book exclusive mm -hmm. to them. And that's what I want, okay? So we're here to play gacha. <laughs> and if this guy is gonna take all my gold, I'll kill him. <laughs> he keeps giving me garbage though. <laughs> cool, thanks for the gravel. So, <laughs> I, I wonder, is there like an American equivalent to gacha? I feel like slot machines is like a thing, right? Is there? Because I know that the gacha pawn is like this thing that like you, you, you deposit money and you get like a random gift of random value. Stop giving me gravel! Actually, it might be useful. Hold on. You never know. There you go, friend. You know, I, I relate to these guys. I relate to these guys. You base mm -hmm. a stream on an American city and then wonder if gambling is big in the States. Good point. I, I, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, it, it's like an American equivalent to gacha. Because gacha is a very Japanese thing, you know? Gave me something good. <sighs> well, soul sand and blackstone. Cool. Come on. <laughs> Withered. This is crazy, man. Why is it only giving me garbage? Wait, what? Hey, that's decent. Alright, because I'm pretty sure that you can get Soul Step. And that's what I want, because that's a really, really good book. <laughs> Maybe because you put him in prison. Hey. That... <laughs> Okay, fair point. But here's the thing though, Luna. How does he have all this stuff in prison? Like, I keep giving him gold and he keeps giving me dirt. Blackstone, soul set, craft obsidian. <laughs> Nether brick. Okay, fine, fine, fine. So if I free him, if I free him... There you go, friend. There you go. Listen, now he has freedom, so now he should give me good shit. Very large colon. <laughs> Listen, a human colon is 7 meters. A piglin colon is 70 meters. Wait, come back. I know you have more stuff for me. Or do I need to find a different employee? Welcome to Sumio Wastes All His Gold. The stream. We still need to wait for Stenhawk to come here, even though he just died, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure. Stenhawk? Did he just die? Yes. <laughs> no, Stenhawk! Twice. Okay, withered, withered, withered. I think we need to pick up Stenhawk, because it's not going well for him. A fire charge? Oh. Actually, friend, if you can stay here for me for a while. Stay here. I'll be right back. Alright, let's pick up Stenhawk and bring him to the casino. Let's see. Stenhawk, where are you right now? In the overworld? Because you want to see if you can... Oh, hold on. Yeah. Because, okay, so the thing for me is that, like, on Friday, um, it's still... It, it's a very hard day to stream at. But I still feel like it should be possible, as long as you have, if I have the right streaming times, you know? Um. Okay, wait. Stenhawk, what are your coordinates right now? Cowl? Yes. Ow! Hey! Okay. One, one, three, six. Yeah. So you're nearby. Yeah. And what do you see? <laughs> That's a long way out. Okay. Hold on. Crap, shoot. Because <laughs> the thing is, I have another Minecraft stream prepared, technically, but I don't know when to do it. Because I'm pretty sure that next Friday... Uh, yeah, okay, so next Friday is my stream with Jeep. 
And then Saturday is Origami. Which means that the next Minecraft stream isn't going to be... I think for two weeks. So... Okay, wait, let's, let's, let's see if we can pick up Stan Hawk and then bring him to the, to the Chamber of Death. That seems like a good reward. Although, you know, it could be a Chamber of Death. I just want to see, like, between the three of us, who can survive the Antonic Roulette. Mm. Contestant number two. Oh, he's in the swamp, isn't he? Yikes. Okay. So weird, I can't do this. I don't have feather falling on my gold armor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, 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 you fucking flex your nether stuff. Alright. Is the nether portal big in the nether? Yes, it's huge. It's, it, it's, it's, it's a maximum size. Which is apparently 23, 23 by 23. Okay, hold on. Wait, what? Oh, hey, did we find your house? Ugh, I hate the swamp sounds in this game. Eh. Right. Because it also sucks for me for the weekend streaming times, right? So, on Friday and Saturday, uh, I very, very often have my family to visit here in the evenings. And sometimes when it's too late at night, I sleep here. So that's for me, it's a signal to be like, all right, let's, let, let's, wait, what? Hey, Weirder, do you have any flint for me? Do you have any, um, burable material? Well. I'm back. Well, welcome back to, um... Missile Man's final hideout. Well, I guess, I guess here, here's his fucking grave. Withered? Piss on it. Okay. <laughs> Crispier than before. Oh, man. Poor David. I'm by the giant portal. Oh! Oh, 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 okay. How did you get there? Because in that case, you're... Alright. I'll look in the mountains. Alright. Let's go pick up Stenhawk and then play some roulette. <clears throat> so, I was actually wondering, right? Um, oh, first of all, welcome back, David, and when you say crispier than before, do you mean that you got fucking... Like, co Wait, how? what is the time right now in Mexico? It should be the same as, like, the USA, so it's, like, minus 7. So it's, like... It's, like, 5, 6 p.m.? Found another portal. Okay. Okay, we'll try to enter and not get brutalized. Which is hard, because it's another... 3.30. Oh! 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 Okay, 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 so, so it's minus 9, even. That is a big time zone. Wait, how many time zones does Mexico have compared to the USA? And it was right by the big one. Okay, yeah, that's, that's true. There's, there, there's two of them. There's two of them. There, there's one that goes to Nameless's house. And one that goes to, uh, to uh, the entrance. It's PST. Ah, okay. Didn't know that. Creepo. Oh, Jesus. Ow. Okay. So yeah, so so next week I'm going to gamble a little bit with the times, because um, cause next week on Monday and Tuesday I'm going to be unavailable, because my work uh, is kicking me to a course halfway across the country, which I have to partake in, or else I get fired, because <laughs> that's funny. That's something that happens every fucking week. Um, wait, where's the portal again? It's over here somewhere. And... On Wednesday, I'll be back with Horror Game. Then, then Thursday will be Outlast. Then Friday will be Jeep. And then Saturday will be Origami. So that's going to be the schedule for next week. <coughs> and... Yeah, right? Wait. Uh, yeah, so Wednesday, Horror Game. And then Thursday, Fallout. Friday, Jeep's Variety Show. Uh, the acting stream. And then Saturday, Origami. Then Sunday... Something else? I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Alright, Stenhawk, welcome. Do you need food or do you need something? Or do you need gold? Food, okay. In that case, Stenhawk, let's go to the casino. Let's play a game of uh, Sumio will win by default. <laughs> Listen, I am not going to rig my casino, okay? However, if Baka was still here, 
if Baka was still here, I would put six lava buckets in there the moment he stepped into the chamber. But not you guys, not you guys. No, 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 no. I'm gonna be fair, I'm gonna be fair. <laughs> Sumio, why do you bully Baka? Ooh, shiny. <laughs> uh... Oh, hey, I can... Okay, I can make something right here. How much garbage you made for Dory, man? Right, hold on. Let me deposit the gold. Alright, so who wants to step into the, cha into the chamber first? I hope this is worth it. I lost a stack of 80 81 birth locks. Sorry. I will replace that. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So who wants to go in first? Shall I go in first, Withered or Stenhawk? Because here's the thing about Russian Roulette, right? Everybody has equal chances. If I survive the first one, one of you two is next. Alright. Huh? Volunteers? Volunteers? Who wants to go into the chamber first? Wait, Withered, where did you go? Foolish Samurai. Okay, so Stenhawk, do you have any stuff on you? Because if you do, you might want to deposit them in this chest. There's a stuck pig by the entrance, I'm doing gotcha. Yeah, that's true. Wait, what? Don't you mean this guy right here? He despawned. Oh, come on. Where, where's my fucking... Where's my prisoner? Aw. Put some food in the big chest. Okay. Okay, well, in that case, Stenhawk, how about you and I go first, okay? Alright, so Stenhawk, do you want to go first, or shall I go first? I think I heard the answer right there. <laughs> Alright, Stenhawk, step on the pressure plate. Oh, crap. Well, that's not, that's not good for me. Also, Stenhawk, if you win, uh, you can get whatever you want. That's bucket one, now it's my turn. And I... Okay, so here's the thing. I should allow you out right here. And only if you survive, Stenhawk, you should press this button right here and should let me out, okay? So if I win, uh, I, 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 as I, like, I survive, you should press this button and let me out. Understand? Okay. Well then, Stenhawk, wish me uh, good luck. <laughs> okay, so can you let me out? Because that was round two. And now, for you... 25% chip. Alright, here we go. Your turn, Stenhawk. Shit. <laughs> now it's one in three. Uh oh. Okay, well, here we go. <sighs> okay. You can, you can make this a little bit more interesting. You can do this as well. And now it can shoot out like a bucket. But let's not do that. Let's not do that. <laughs> 50 50. 50 50. So stand up. If you, if you survive right now, I'm 100% dead. Let's go. 50-50. Wait, 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 what? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We might have some scuff right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is bullshit. This is rigged. Okay, do it again, do it again. Step on it. Do it again, cheating. <laughs> I don't want to die. I don't want to die again. Oh, wait, what? Oh, so it is randomized, so I, I just had bad luck. <laughs> Wait, so we actually... We actually made it all the way to the final bullet? And I was going to die 100%, but I was like, wait a minute, is this thing correct? And the very first thing... Does it mean I win? Yes, it means you win. Well, lava is attracted to you. That, that might be the case. That might be the case. Hold on. 
Yes, Ten Hag, you win. You win. Hold on. Let me let me just see if I can survive this. Hmm. Okay, how about this? Eight bullets in the chamber and... I mean... Uh, eight duds and one lava bucket. Right. I should just pass the obsidian right here. Uh, that's good. Yes, you win, Stenhawk. So, Stenhawk, is there anything you want or anything you need in Minecraft? Because I'll give it to you. Oh, I just need I need to clean up the mess. Hold on. <laughs> so glad I'm not the only one who has, you know, a house. <laughs> yes, I can give that to you. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Okay, I will lose my shit if I actually lose the one in nine. If I get if I get the eleven percent and it kills me, it's gonna be a clip for YouTube, man. It's gonna be a clip for YouTube. Okay, that's one bullet. That's two bullets. That's three. That's four. That's five. That's a bucket. Oh, I should remove the, uh, the cylinders. Oh, almost, almost. I came close, I came close, I came really close. Weird, this is torture. Withered, I'm stuck in here now. I can't die. This is literally hell. <laughs> Sumio, you were gambling and you shall burn forever. Also, Withered, I think moment this runs out, I'm fucking dead. But okay. Thank you for saving me, Withered. Thank you. You, 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 you'll get pro Withered, you'll get a promotion to casino manager. Which means that you will get to deal with the angry customers, not me. <laughs> oh no. Which is worse in this case, Kool-Aid or lava? Kool-Aid. Are you kidding me? Listen, I would rather get doused into an ocean of lava than fucking Kool-Aid. Ugh. You know it's coming. So Stenhawk won, so I need to give him a house now. Well, okay, so I guess next Minecraft stream making a house of Stenhawk. <laughs> Let's see. What is what is like a more of a like a shitty ass game? How about 50-50? So no, you can't do that. Like four, four on four. Like I want to see here. How can we challenge the odds? Like maybe three on four, three on five. Oh, I have an idea. I have an idea. I have an idea. Oh, we're gonna play reverse Russian roulette. <laughs> If this is possible, if this is possible, <laughs> hold on. I want to see if this is possible. Okay, th they call me the luckiest man in Antarctica. No, they don't. Okay, I failed. Oh, uh oh, withered, withered. The, the door. <laughs> Okay, that might that might not end well. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, 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 guys, 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 guys. Let's let's play the game for real now. Okay, all three of us are right here. There can only be one winner. Okay. So I'm gonna fill this with two lava buckets and the rest is water. Okay, because you know it's two of us. Sumio, no cheating. And end the grab and the chest with stuff. Okay. No cheating, no cheating, no, 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 no. Okay, so. Oh, I need, I need, I need to clean up. Hold on, clean, clean up the goo, clean up the goo. Fucking. Ah, right, there you go. <laughs> Sumio M. What do you mean clean up the goo? Oh, that goo. Well. <laughs> One of these days, Gure is going to redeem twenty thousand Kool Aid, and that'll be um. Oh boy. Yeah. Okay. 
with it. If you have an energy chest, we can use that. And let's see which of us three is the luckiest member in Antarctica, okay? Because we sure as hell know it's not me. Oh man, I really want to cheat. I really want to cheat. That the moment that Stanhawk enters the chamber... <laughs> I'm part Irish. Nice. Nice. Let's go, Irish crew! Wait, Stanhawk, you're an American, right? Yeah, 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 you are, you are, you are. I know you are. Okay, no cheating, no cheating, no cheating. Okay, listen, 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 guys. Guys, if Baka was right here, and he would be in a chamber, I would fill all nine stars with lava. But I'm not gonna do that, okay? I'm not gonna do that. Fair play. Okay. So, we have two bullets, and we have seven duds, alright? So, if Wither returns... Let's see who's gonna be the luckiest man in Tarika. Let's see who's gonna be. Part Iris versus part Iris versus Sumio. Exactly. I have no Iris blood in me, man. I'm sorry, like... <laughs> Doesn't mean I don't have other countries in my blood. Exactly, exactly. And I, I'm pretty sure that my American side of the family is all Italian. Because they are all short people with black hair and they have an Italian surname. So they might be Italian. So I think that I, I'm some kind of like weird mix between Italian, German and more German. Okay, Stenhawk. Go in. Let's see if you're lucky enough. But can you cook pasta, though? <laughs> okay. Pizza time. Yep. The fucking Spider-Man Spider song? I will blast that. I will blast that. Alright, so the first bullet is empty. So... With it, do you want to go next? Because I, I sure as hell don't want to. Can I come out? Yes, yes, yes. We need to re release him. Congrats, you win. I right, withered. Good luck. It's your turn. Cooking hot dogs. Chia chia ma chia ma. Chia 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 ma. Chia 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 that's not good for me, because that lowers my odds. Okay, crap. Oh, here we go. My turn. Sumio next. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, how, how, how about I skip my turn? Can I do that? <laughs> Leroy Jenkins. Are you kidding me? Are you absolutely kidding me? Are you joking? Of course, the moment I step into the chamber, lava. <laughs> Fucking asshole. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Unreal. Okay, fine. So so uh, so I'm already out. So it's in between you two guys now. It's between you two now. <laughs> I hate this. Why why are my odds so fucking shitty when it comes to lava? Like the, the moment lava is involved, it just magnetizes to me every single time. Okay, first the trailer, then the zombie, and now this. You have to be joking. <laughs> we got company. We do? Oh, you mean enemies? Oh, don't worry. Alright, well, Sumio is fucking dead. So let me just uh, recover the bullet from that. I Listen, guys. I don't think I'm ever going to do a Russian roulette stream. Alright, so... Yeah, so Stenok is up next. Five water buckets and one lava bucket. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? Let's go. I, I can see Wither surviving all of this. Okay. Stenok is still really lucky. Stenok has, has not gotten a single lava bucket yet. Because the thing is, when me and Stenok played together, the lava bucket was 100% for me. Alright, Wither, let's go. No, no. 
No. Get in. There you go. Okay. Okay. Okay, listen, listen, guys, guys. If it if it somehow ends up being 50-50, I want to be the one to enter the chamber for the, for the last one. Because at that point, I might be convinced that this game is fucking, like, racist against Antarcticans. Alright, Stanhawk, your turn. Are you kidding me? Wait. Okay, Withered, your turn. One in three. One in three. Oh. No, that doesn't work. Hold on, I'll do it. There you go. Alright, hold on, Withered. <laughs> Wait, what? This is absolutely, this is madness. This is complete madness. Okay, so Stenhawk, 50-50, again. Okay, Sumio, your turn. Okay, fine, fine. I'm so sick of this game. I'm so sick of this. Kurei, thank you for, thank you for Senna. This is so bullshit. Every time I enter the chamber, it's lava, lava, lava. Okay, so I guess then I can win it win because I died twice. Luck <laughs> of the Irish is real. This is fucking bullcrap. Why is my own game rigged against me? <laughs> Fuck this. <laughs> Here's your actual price, though. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> well, there it is. Yep, it's time. All right. Time for cool late. All right, so let me just log off real quick here. All right, let's see. <clears throat> let's get a cool light back. Save for a cooking stream. I could, I could do you one better. I could do you one better. Oh, right now, your choice. Well, the thing is that it, it is supposed to be right now. However, um, I have an idea. Next Saturday, during the origami stream, we're gonna be doing Kool-Aid, okay? However, you can choose right now, Kure, because I have some flavors here. I have some flavors here for you today. Let's see. I have um, I have strawberry. I have um, I have uh, mixed berry. I have um. um I have, a, I have a, like a big bag prepared where I keep all my cooking ingredients. Yeah, let's see. I have cherry. I have berry cherry, which is different apparently. I have watermelon. And I have peach mango. And finally... And that's it. That's it. Okay, so... Here we go. Watermelon. Your choice on when to drink. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. So that means that watermelon is redeemed by Gure. Alright. And, um... Do we want to do it now? Or do we want to do it during the origami stream? Or during the beginning of the next stream? Okay. 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 Uh, so... So here's my, here's my idea, Gure. At the very start of the origami stream next week... I will drink the very condensed watermelon Kool-Aid. And when I say very condensed, I mean it's going to be a glass of water. That's going to be suffering again, because the thing is... I, don't, I feel like watermelon Kool-Aid is fucking disgusting. But we'll see, we'll see. Gure, thank you for redeeming the 20k. That was going on your name. 
and that one is going to happen next Saturday during the origami stream. No, that's content. <laughs> it is, it is, but it is content. But I feel like watermelon Kool-Aid is fucking disgusting. However, I think that every Kool-Aid is disgusting. Okay, okay, so, so my fellow Americans, can you guys tell me what is the best flavor of Kool-Aid? Because I have mixed berry, strawberry, black cherry, uh, normal cherry, peach mango, and watermelon. Deal, but have a gallon of water when you drink one. Okay, okay, I'll do a gallon. Alright, so that means that next Saturday, uh, during the origami stream at the very beginning, we're gonna do Kool-Aid watermelon. So that's gonna be suffering. And Gure will decide the amount of water. And Gure says a gallon. I haven't had it in so long, but for other flavored drinks, cherry tends to be good. I believe that. I believe that. But what is a gallon into a liter? Jesus Christ, that is a lot of water. <laughs> Three liters? <laughs> okay, okay, so, so cherry might be good then. Okay, okay, I'm saving that, I'm saving that. Alright, so that means... Uh, or a liter. Okay. Alright. We can do that. We, we, can, we can either do a shit ton of water... Get ready to pee. <laughs> welcome, well, welcome to Sumio Goes to the Bathroom stream. Yeah, that'll be fun. Did you guys know that there's actually a lot of um, a lot of live stream clips out there of people who accidentally have like their microphone still on them while they go to the toilet? Like that is a fucking fail if you do that. There's so many clips out there of people who like are like, "Be right back, guys. I'm going to go, I'm going to go to the bathroom," and you just and you just hear them. Like, empty their bowels on stream. And I'm like, bruh. Bruh. <laughs> God. And, okay, so, so here's, here's a funny part. Um, reminds me of someone. If, if, not me, not me. I, 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 I haven't, haven't done it yet. Um, so here's a funny part, right? And it, it's, it's a pretty humiliating story, but it is very funny to, to share one. Um, in my second year of university, we had a guest speaker over. And the guest speaker, um, at the very beginning of the lecture, um, had this, like, microphone on his collar, right? He had this, like, this small chipped microphone on his collar. And he forgot to take it off. Because right before the lecture, he had to go to the bathroom. He kept it on. And if you are in a lecture hall with, like, 500 people, you have these, like, gigantic boxes in every corner, right? These gigantic speakers that, like, blast noise out of every corner of the room. So imagine sitting in a fucking lecture hall with 500 people and the guy who's giving the lecture is going to the bathroom and... <laughs> and you hear that guy fucking deliver a number two and a number one at the same time in the bathroom without him realizing it. At first, at first, the people in the lecture hall was like, okay, somebody is, like, pranking us, right? Like, there's, like, some malicious students, you know, probably Sumio again, that piece of shit, that, like, is playing some kind of disgusting, like, porn or something on, on, the, on the speakers. But no, that poor guy, that poor guy went to the bathroom unknowing with a fucking chip on his collar, and he just, like, bombed 500 people. And after he was done, he had no idea. He had no idea. The entire... The entire lecture hall was like, bruh. And that guy just went on with his day, with, 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 like, with like his lecture and all that. Holy fuck. <laughs> I like to think to this day that he knew exactly what he was doing. <laughs> no shame. No shame. I feel so bad for the guy, but he had no idea. I got a copper ingot from a drowned. Oh, really? Nice. Jesus. Alright, well, anyways, uh, Antonic Roulette, fuck this shit. I, I keep dying. I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this. Wait, hold on. Please, for the love of God, tell me. Tell me, tell me it's not true. I can't 
win. I can't win. No matter what I do, I can't win. I hate this. Screw this. <laughs> well, we can add to the Laura book that lava is attracted to Sumio. Sumio is a living magma magnet. Wait. I don't know. I don't know. No, no. Tia. Tia, help me here. Tia, help me. Tia. I, I, I need a bun. I need a bun. Please. <laughs> Fuck this. So done. <laughs> so done. <laughs> Even one in three, I can't win. All right, Stan Hawk and Withered, if you guys are still here, let's go on with the stream, okay? Let's go on with the stream. Because there's two more things I want to do. <laughs> Sue Magma Santana. Stan went for dinner and I'm making sure I don't get robbed. Okay. Like, you, you mean IRL or... <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is fucking stupid. <laughs> you should close this. He's in my house because I made him armor and tools. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay. That's very nice of you, Withered. That's very nice of you. Alright, well... Insanity. Alright. So, let me just see if... Oh, wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Okay, how about we don't nuke the casino yet? Okay. Let's, let's not spawn the Wither yet. That's at the very end. I'm so sorry, kitty cat, but your life is going to be cut short. <laughs> I really want to see if I can get this stupid thing. If I can get a piglin to, like, give one to me. Uh, if I can find it, at least. One day the casino lasted. I mean, <laughs> magma net. Tia, help me here. <laughs> By the entrance, okay. I mean, to be fair, this, this casino has been in production for, like, a while. For, like, three days. So, of course... As usual with my streams, every single time I make something, it's gonna be nuked in like the stream. A whole week for setup, gone in an hour. But the entrance? Um, your entrance or my entrance? Now keep an eye on your right. Oh, Chia, you're gonna be a great dad. <laughs> Tia is Tia is a pun master of Antarctica, man. Like, like like Tia has made some puns that I am like, bruh, put those on Twitter. Your entrance, okay. I, I, I like to imagine that like Withered is just like fucking luring me over and there's gonna be like a sign over here that with like a fucking dick on it. Oh it despawned. Yep. Yep. Which is weird because like when when we were making this whole stream. There was pigs fucking everywhere, and now they're gone. Cool. Okay, guess I gotta find some piglins. Sorry, I can barely take care of myself. I refuse to put a challenge on someone else. That's very understandable, Tia. That's very understandable. And, I, I, Tia, I feel like that is a motivation. That is like a sort of way of life that a lot of people um, should come to understand when it comes to children and pets. Because a lot of people don't have that kind of responsibility. Um, a lot of people take pets and uh, children when they're not ready, when they, they can barely take care of themselves. And like, I've had it, I had it for years as well. I've had it for years um, that like, I just couldn't do it. I just had not, not, not the mindset for it. But now I do. Finally, after like six years, I finally am, want to tell myself that like, hey, I am ready to like take care of at least like a pet, you know? The water. The water? Which water? Pig. Can these two grow up yet? Hey, do you, want, do you guys want gold? You guys want some gold? <laughs> they call me Uncle Sumio. Hey, this is good shit right here. How did he die? <laughs> You've had Jon Snow for a while though, that's true, that's true. I've had Jon Snow for, um, ever since I came here, so that's 2000... 
2014 I had him. But Jon Snow is 11 years old. Because he was he was my neighbor's pet at first, before I took him in, because my neighbor was a complete hack. And and said refused to take care of her pet. So I was like, yo, can I have this can I can I have this bunny? And she was like, yeah, sure. And I was like, yes. And I feel like uh, I feel better leaving a dog for eight hours a day. Getting a dog if I could get close to home and walk during my home lunch. Dogs are a big responsibility, yes. And the thing is, like, I got Jon Snow in 2014. So he was already four years old at that point. But the thing is that, like, a rabbit is not that huge of a responsibility. Because the thing with Jon Snow is, like, I feed him twice a day. I give him water twice a day. And that's it. And, 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 and like, the rest, he, like... He, he, just, he just does his thing, you know? Like, he he, he, he he walks around the garden, and he, like, like lays around in the sun, and he, like, sometimes plays with, like, um, the corgi of my little sister, and, you know, he, he's just living his simple life. And that is, that's not a big responsibility, and I feel like a cat and a dog, those are big. Like, those take effort and time. And the thing is that, like, um, I'm proud of my sister for doing her absolute best to raise a corgi. Um, because like those are really cute dogs and like and, and this corgi is by far my sister's best friend but I know that dogs can be um, hard to raise hard to raise and take care for especially if one you're lazy and two if you have no sense of responsibility and I have had people in my family but also friends and especially neighbors that don't have that that have this like um, this whole sense of well, whatever, they will just raise themselves, lol. And they don't. They really don't. Um, and I know that, like, my step family is fucking awful with raising pets. And they they did a good job with, like, the first pet, but then they had the idea that, like, their second pet would, like, learn from their first pet. Which is what's... that, 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 does, that does not happen. Because, because apparently, like, training a dog is really expensive, so they were like, oh, you know, like, the, the second dog will adopt the techniques of the first one. Nope. <clears throat> also, I want to get an English Bulldog. They're very expensive, have health issues. Yes, they do. A lot of dogs do. A lot of dogs do. If you want a pure breed dog, Chia, very big chance they have health issues and they will not live long. And that is tragic to me. It's tragic. And I hate to see it. I hate to see things like puppy mills. And like breeding mills and like um, animal farms. I hate that. And yet, you know, the <sighs> my first dog is a puppy mill rescue. A rescue? Nice. Okay, well done, Beerus. But how did you rescue it though? Mm -hmm. Like, usually, usually they are born in a puppy mill, right? What was I trying to do here again? Oh, right, 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 right. So, there's two more things I want to do on the stream. Also, David, welcome back. Again. <laughs> I didn't rescue him. We adopted him from the person who rescued him. Yeah, okay, so, well... Okay, so, 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 I, so I did the same with Jon Snow, technically. Because the thing is that, like, um... My neighbor bought that rabbit for her kid. But her kid didn't really care. And then she didn't care. And then I was like, well... I want it, because the thing is, I've had many, 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 many pets in my life, many. You see hamsters, guinea pigs, and rabbits. We did basically rescue a second dog. Th th that's how you're supposed to do it. That's how you're supposed to do it. Always rescue a pet. Don't buy one. Don't adopt one. Rescue one. There's a lot of pets out there. There are great animals that need a home. And, you know, are currently not having a good life. So... You know, for your sake and their sake, you know, I would say do that. Um, which is which is which is why I currently currently I'm in a mindset in my life, in which I can tell myself that like okay, I I can take care of myself now, but I can also take care of a pet. And it's the first time in six years I'm able to say that to myself. Um, that like you know I, I I know that I am in a state of mind where I know I can take care of. <coughs> Of a, of, of a meow, yeah. <laughs> Luna, thanks for the meow. That, that, that might be one of the last meows uh, in this stream because very soon it'll get replaced by uh, corn. But, but but yeah, like and and, and and like for six years, I haven't I haven't had that feeling because a rabbit is not that high maintenance of a pet, you know. But like a cat and a dog, those are big. Those are big. Um, 
Pig. Give me something good or I'll kill you. Yeah. <sighs> the, the whole stream is gonna be me gambling. Hey. Is that a potion? Oh, that's useful. It's a good thing that my state actually has a really good mentality for rescuing pets. So there's a goodwill in there. Ow! Actually, that's good to hear, Chia. That's good to hear. Because a lot of states don't have that. And um, I've seen a lot of documentaries about how things are in Asia. And in Asia, especially Korea, China, uh, Vietnam, Cambodia. Holy crap. It's, it's very bad. It's very bad. Um... Especially because there's a lot of strays in those countries. And, and, and in China, of course, they eat cats and dogs, which is awful. Um, but like... <laughs> Sumio is here by banned from China. Yeah, yeah. But... The, the, the thing is that like... Welcome back, Stanhawk. Ow. Now get out of my house. <laughs> Leave! Um... So, yeah, you know, this could have been different. They really could have been. Um, okay, so two more things I want to do here. Because I know for a fact that Stenhawk is not prepared to fuck some shit up. But I know that me and Withered are. So, Withered, if you can follow me to the jungle biome. Because I think that I will do the gambling with the piglins off stream to get that legendary book. Because it's going to take a while. I gotta head out for now, I'll catch you later. Thanks for the fun stream, Sumio. No problem, Luna. Luna, thanks for thanks stopping by, and thanks for allowing us to, um, to, to ruin your server once again. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, can I really not get anything? No problem. Alright. <laughs> later, Luna. Listen, I, I promise, I promise that the, 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 the wither will not screw up the nether. I promise. Because I think that I will run away for my life when a thing spawns. But, but what? <laughs> Sumio, you, you, you said the B word. Um, man, this is all garbage. Give me something good, you stupid pigmen. Enough. <laughs> There's like a one percent chance of you getting that book, so that's that's bad. All right, Withered, if you can follow me, I found something that I want to mm, discover. Gacha rarely plays, yet yeah, they do. Man, e e even Gacha in Minecraft is fucking evil. How, how can you? Can you even imagine? Oh, hey, Stenhawk. Oh, nice, Stenhawk. You can join us in our Bastion Raid. So, we did a Bastion Raid as well in the last server, in New Antarctica. And it ended in disappointment, because the Bastion was, well, empty. So this time, this time... Let's go! Alright. I'm pretty sure that the entrance to the jungle biome is on top of the... On top of the casino. Bye! Right. Ooh. God damn. Also, I will upload me dying to lava in pure stupid luck <sighs> on YouTube because, like, what the fuck are the odds of that? Four times in a row. Okay. Unreal. I, I can't believe the only person that has died so far to the fucking Antarctic slot machine was me. Because the other time with Stenhawk, that was my lava because it was 100% gonna be my death, but well, you know, Stenhawk took it for me. No, 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 no. Hey, come on. Gout! <laughs> he starts attacking me. He's like, hmm, thanks for the gold. Okay, so there's two things I want to do left in the stream. 
And apart from, of course, the angry customer, also known as Karen. Uh, let's go to the jungle biome. There's a shield in your inventory. Oh, you, oh, you need that. All right, I'm pretty sure the entrance to the jungle biome is right. Here, 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 here. Okay, here it is. Come on, guys, let's go. Because I found something fun to do. So, so yeah, you know, pets... Um, and I feel like a pet is a big responsibility. A, a, a cat and a dog, they are. They, they, they simply are. Especially since they need a lot of care and attention. And, like, the thing is, my whole life I've had rodents. And rodents, they don't give a fuck. They really don't. Rodents just do their thing, and when they need food, they become loud. They're loud. And other than that, they just, you know, li live their life. Um, especially hamsters can be little bastards. Like, hamsters, you cannot raise them. You really can't. Uh, but you can treat them nice, you can treat them nice, you, 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 you can give them like a good life, you know. Um, and hamsters, um, I've had five of them in my life, five of them. And they all live very short lives, they all die within two to two and a half years. And then that's it, that's it. And hamsters are fun and all, but you can't have much interactions with them. Because the thing is, like, hamsters, they don't like to get... They, they, they don't want to get pet. They hate that. I'd rather have a tarantula than a rodent for a pet. Understandable. Understandable. Tar tar tarantulas are really cool. Um, but the thing is that, yeah, um, sometimes the bigger rodents, those are really fun. Because... Um, because, you know, I had... Hamsters and guinea pigs, and they are kind of boring. Because, like, they don't give a fuck. Like, they like to eat, they like to, like, you know, enjoy themselves and, like, dig, and, and that's it. Um, but, like, rabbits and rats, those are different. Those are a lot different. Are you guys still following me? Oh, you are. Okay. Um, and the thing is that um, both of them are very interactive with you. Especially if you raise them, especially if you, like, get them to, like... You know, know your smell and know like that like that that you're not a, a threat a danger then they they will come over to you they will come over to you and they will like seek attention you know which is awesome which is why i like rabbits and rats now i've only had one rat in my entire life and i have had three rabbits but they are great pets they really are um merry <laughs> christmas you filthy animal oh nice hey uh romsey kane romsey romsey keen romsey Ke Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to Minecraft Casino. Even though we're already at the, the, the latter half of the stream, but... Um, so now we're talking about pets. And rats. I knew a girl a while ago that had a rat for a pet. It was pretty cool. It is! It is! It is! Rats are awesome. Um, and the thing is, like, rats, they love to climb on you. They love to, like, climb and sit on your shoulder and, like, do their thing. And, like, you can just feed them like a parrot. And that's so cool. Anyways, I think this is it. Welcome to... Bastion. It didn't like me at all, but I, I, but it loved her. I know, I know. Like rats are awesome. Rats and rabbits are so cool. Um, you know, I had a hamster. The hamster was an ass. Same here. Same here. So the last hamster I owned that died in 2018, he was an asshole, and that was probably because I gave him an asshole name because I named him Rasputin, and you know, <laughs> I don't I don't think anyone wants to be named Rasputin. So. <laughs> But that, that hamster was a dick. And I think I told the story before, but that this hamster always bit me. This hamster always bit me. Whenever I tried to grab him, whenever I tried to like uh, uh, put it in my hands, that hamster... You changed your name to Grey? Oh, that's awesome. That's an awesome pet name. It is, but like he didn't like it. Hey guys, do you see that over there? Do you see that? Do you guys see that? Eh? Eh? I want it. I want it. <laughs> and... The thing is that, like, the other hamsters I had, they were not assholes. But I always had them together. I had five hamsters, and the first two were siblings, and the second two were siblings. And instead of attacking me, they attacked each other. Like, hamsters? Holy fuck. Those two will kill each other if they're in the same cage. Is that gold? Yes, it is. I came here earlier the, this week, and I was like, wait a minute, is that... Is that... Nani... Bakana... Gold... Oro... Oh shit, oh shit. Come here. He's gone. 
Gold? <laughs> Good right, thanks for the gold. Yes. I want it. I want it. Problem is though, the, the moment we get it, how do we get out of here? Because we need to go from there to there. So, whoop, journey mode. <coughs> and the thing is that like, the moment I realized that my hamster was an asshole is when my dad um, put him in his hand for a while. So my dad loves animals, he really does. And even though currently he's too old to own any or like take care of any animals, he still loves them. And, he's, and he and he loves Jon Snow. He loves Jon Snow. Like, if, if there's one person in my life that loves Jon Snow more than me, it's my dad. Holy shit. My, my dad loves to come over to my house and, like, give, like, Jon Snow an entire cabbage. And I'm like, bruh. But, you know, <laughs> I'm like, I'm dead. Did, did, did you really buy, like, 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 an entire carrot or, like, an entire cabbage for Jon Snow? And he's like, yeah. I'm like, oh. But that hamster was an asshole. And the reason that why Rasputin was an asshole is because when my dad put him in his hands, he waited his turn until he did something. So my dad was like lying on the couch with like the hamster on his chest, because you know, that's really fun to do to see like the hamster, you know, run around in front of your eyes. The first thing that my that, that, that Rasputin did, Rasputin ran to my dad's face and bit his lip open. He literally took a fucking chunk out of his lower lip. And it was bleeding everywhere. I was like, this hamster's a fucking dick. Because the other hamsters didn't do that. And at that point, I was like, okay, Rasputin, you're a fucking asshole, you know that? And I, I blame myself. I blame myself. Because it feels like hamsters can be raised to, like, you know, not bite. Um, but alas, alas, you know. Ooh! Okay. So here's the thing, though. This was, well, something. But there's more bastions. So apparently, Withered, according to you, there's four bastions on the road to the jungle biome. So if that's true, then... <laughs> Let's do a little bit of exploration. But first, how do we get out of here? <laughs> Guys? Um, how do we escape from the bastion? <laughs> um, but yeah, the, the thing is that, like... Um, I still loved Rasputin. He was still like a very funny and all around like cute animal, but he was he was a dick. And I feel like that's my fault. Um, because what happened is, and I will never forget this for the rest of my life, because I, I still feel awful about it. Um, he died because of my stupidity. So when he was a really, really old animal, uh, like basically like 85 in like... Um, animal years. Um, I, 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 I had him in my hands and he was already like basically blind as, as a bat and like one of his legs stopped working. And as usual, Rasputin, knowing full well that he would 100% bite me, uh, he, he bit me in my middle finger and out of sheer reaction, I dropped him. I dropped him on the floor. So he fell like three feet to the floor, and it was just like, tick, and that's it. Game over. And it's so brutal to think about, because I will never forget that moment. I will never forget that moment in my life. Because I knew very well that that would fucking happen. And the thing is, you can't reanimate a hamster. You, 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 can't, give, you can't give him mouth to mouth, even though I tried. Um, you know, when like, a hamster that's like 85 years old in human years falls on the floor. They're done for. So he was just there lying on the floor, mouth open, stretched out, and motionless. And I was like, oh fuck. I wouldn't consider that your fault, chief. I'm not so sure. I, because I blame myself because I knew very well that even though he's a stubborn old man now, he will bite me. I know he will. I know he will. And, and, and he did. And he did. And of course, the normal reaction to getting bitten is that you flittle your hand, that, 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 that like your hand goes, ah, you know? And... and uh, th thanks, thanks, Ten Hawk, I needed that. And I still feel guilty about it, because, because it happened on March 28, 2019. I will never forget that day. Because I was like, fuck, man. Um... But, th but that's not even the worst part of it all. The worst part is that I actually made like a... I made a grave for him. I made, I made a tomb. I made a small tomb for him, for Rasputin. 
and I did it in my backyard. And I made it in my backyard, and it was slightly, slightly in my neighbor's yard. And my neighbor, being the fucking disgraceful piece of fucking shit he is, he immediately destroyed that grave. So I made a little grave with a picture of him on it. And I want to have it there for like a day. Because, you know, as like a memorial, you know. But my neighbor was like, hey, that's my fucking territory. You can't fucking plant that shit in my fucking garden. And I was like, fuck you, man. Fuck you. Fuck you. So, yeah, you know, so, so that's the story of Rasputin. And I had him for two and a half years. And this is the longest a hamster ever survived for me. Because the other two hamsters that I had, well, they all became two years old, but um, they died because of fighting. Because the thing, what I didn't realize is that, like, okay, so hamsters are very territorial, even if they're siblings. So many, 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 many times throughout my life, um, when I owned hamsters, and you put them in the same cage, eventually when they grow up, you hear, out of nowhere, you just hear, is what you hear, just, and you're like, what the fuck is that noise? And you just see, you just see this small ball of anger, like, connected to each other. You just see this small ball of, of hairy rage. And you have to, like, pull them to, you have to, like, pull them out of each other's claws. Because that's how vicious they are. They are vicious little bastards. And even when you, like, mice are like that too. Yeah, they are. They are. Hamsters too. And even when you finally pull them out together and they're both covered in blood... Even then, they're still ready for like round two because then, like their 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 mouths still like magnetize towards each other. It's vicious. It's fucking vicious. So that's why I'm like, okay, hamsters never again. But the thing is, I will always love rabbits and rats. Um, but there's one thing about rabbits and rats that is not so great, and that is the fact that they piss everywhere. Those like rab rats and rabbits, they love to piss. Okay, they love to piss fucking everywhere. Big pools of orange piss. And the reason they do that is because of territorial marking and because of leaving their smell behind. Oh, here, oh here's Bessie number two, by the way. Right there. You see it? Problem is, though, how do we reach it? This one's going to be harder. Yes. Because how are we going to get over there? Um, and the thing is, like, I've had rats before. Uh, only one. But I've... Uh, but, like, my friend... Um, who, 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 funnily enough, is called Sam. That's, that's, his, that's his name. Um, I actually was allowed to sit his rats for eight weeks. And those are such cute animals, man. Like, they were fucking hilarious. And the thing is that, like, Sam warned me about one thing. And that was like, okay, you know, because of territorial marking, they're gonna piss everywhere. And I was like, okay. And I didn't realize because, like, you know... Because rats, you can let them out of the cage the whole day long. And they and they'll behave and just have fun. You, you, you know that you know they can. Um, and the moment that happened, I didn't realize because like the morning I woke up and I went to my living room, the rats pissed fucking everywhere. Like, it was all covered in piss. <laughs> it was uh, it was pretty bad. It was pretty bad. And the thing is, like the rats were proud of it. They were like, hell yeah, we fucking marked new territory. <laughs> You dirty rat, you little shit. Okay, okay. So, 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 fucking Chia. You, you, you know, you know the fucking gif of like, of like this man, this like man hand that like strangles this really fat rat. You, you, you fucking know that gif. <laughs> That's basically how I felt because because, because I, I basically grabbed both of them by like the chest and I was like, you fucking. <sighs> the cow is by me. Yes. Give it. Oh fuck, my kneecaps. Actually, my, more like my everything. Yeah, so... And the thing is, like, ever since then, like, rats are so funny. Because rats just, like, when, when they're bored, they'll just climb on you. Like, for example, you, you, you're just fucking sitting, doing your thing. And they're like, hey, man, what's up? And they just climb on you, and they just fucking sit, sit on your shoulder or your head. And then they're like, you know... Do you think Remy pissed on the green's head? 100%. Yes, 100%. Yes, he did. And rabbits are a little bit more passive. The, uh oh, hey guys, I think I know what that is. There are there's a fat pigger. There are there's a fat piglin. Look at him. I think this is called a berserk piglin. Oh, Stanhawk, don't fuck with that. That that thing is vicious. 
I'm pretty sure these are really, really, really tough enemies. But I can defeat them with the power of gold. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I soloed one. Uh, well, nice, well done. But I'm pretty sure they're everywhere. Because the thing is, like, we did a Bastion raid once before, and we kind of found jack shit. But I wonder, like, what else is in here? Because I know for a fact that Bastions have, like, a chest at the very bottom with goodies inside. So, we should probably go there. Yep, okay. But yeah, like, rabbits are more passive. Rabbits, nice sumio imitation, Piglin. Yeah, exactly. F f fucking Piglin doing a fucking sumio, uh... <laughs> yeah. Doing a fucking sumio. Step one, get, get, get distracted by gold. Step two, fall in lava. There you go. <laughs> Listen, all I'm saying is, sumio bucks is going to be fun Sunday. <laughs> Holy shit. Wait, so I'm pretty sure that at the very... So, um, there goes all my diamond stuff, there goes all my netherite stuff, there goes, um, <sighs> there goes my name tag, there goes a shit ton of gold, there goes my fucking netherite pickaxe, and there goes my fucking netherite boots that I saved from... Oh, also all my weapons, all my weapons, cool, cool, yep, so that's the end of, um... Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, you know what, fuck it. You know what guys, you know what, you know what? Let, let's head to the final part of the stream. Let's head to the final part of the stream. Let's head to the final part of the stream, all right? All right? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's time for the grand finale. How about that? Welcome to Sumio is fucking mad. <laughs> I hate lava. Listen, the next fucking next fucking minecraft stream i'm gonna get i'm gonna eradicate all the fucking lava in the nether all of it fuck this fuck this do i have anything saved did, 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 did anything survive well at least the shulker box did well then I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Actually, where, where's my boss fight team? Hold on. Chia. Chia, what was it What was it called again? It was Sino Gears, right? Hmm. Which one was called Sino Gears? Cross team. Oh, there you go. 
I see Brown's graph, but you know, there you go. Let's continue this shit! Oh! Well, at least he's trapped. But actually, he can't he, he can do anything. Um, well, not really, because he can move. Okay, well... <laughs> okay, okay, so... So, uh, back to basic, I guess, once again, I have to get all my shit back. Mother fucker. You know what? I think I'll do two things. So after I, I upload my highlights of my cooking stream, I'm going to upload a compilation of Sumio dying in lava. How about that? Because trust me, I can fill a fucking compilation of that at this point. Jesus Christ, man. <sighs> fucking... Oh, by the way, um, if you wonder what happened to the beacon, because the last time that we beat uh, the Wither, um, we, we did make a beacon. And of course, we put the beacon right on top of a lot of content to work with. Yeah, yeah, this says a lot of material. People are like, oh, Sumio, you fucking jump in lava, uh, you know, it's fucking war pigs. Nice. So angry right now. So fucking angry. All right. Yep. So the beacon, do you see it? There it is. So... Yep, it's right above the dragon egg. There you go. So this is what we have recovered from last time. And this is going up into the sky. Right above the egg itself. Nice. So I guess I need to recover all my shit again, and my food, and my weapons, and my armor. Anyways, that's all I had to show for today. <laughs> and I wonder if the Wither is still fucking up the casino. But we need to probably clean that up once I get all my stuff back. You kind of left it there. It, oh, I mean... I mean, it's stuck, Withered. It, 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 it fucking can't move. It's literally stuck in the bedrock. So whatever. I don't care. He's fucked. So I want to say thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for playing along to Stanhawk, Baka, and Withered. And I really want to see if I can find a different time to stream Minecraft. Because it might be next Sunday or the week afterwards. Um, I have two streams left in the week. Which are tomorrow the uh, collab with Kiaren, uh, which will be on Twitch by the way, and she'll be on YouTube. And that's going to be a very fun one, I'm very excited for that. And then Sunday is going to be the official announcement of the charity stream. Um, I'm going to announce that it is, it is in fact going to be um, a charity on, tw on July 25, and it's going to be a 12 hour long marathon. And I will try to advertise the shit out of that. And then, uh, of course, during that stream Sunday, we'll have a uh, Sumio box. And then next week, uh, the first acting stream featuring Jeep and Cepheus. We're going to be doing The Merchant of Antarctica. 
well, you know, it's like there's like this there's like this is Shakespeare play called the, the Merchant of Venice, but you know the Merchant of Antarctica. Get it? Okay. So um, I'm gonna say thank you for watching me suffer again, um, and of course me, I still haven't learned my fucking lesson, and um, I wanna say have a good weekend, have a good Friday, no matter where you live. And um, I'll see you guys either tomorrow during the collab with Kiaren. Or I will see you guys Sunday during the charity stream announcement. Um, or, and and Sumio Box. Or I will see you um, on Discord or Twitter. Because the next stream uh, is going to be a horror game stream next week. That's just next Wednesday. Then Fallout Thursday. And then acting stream Friday. And Origami on Sunday or Saturday. Raid? Let's raid. Let's do it. All right, let's do it right. Um, well, do you guys have any targets in mind? Because if not, then we're going gonna go back to Puzzle. Mm. Oh, wait. Wait a minute, did, did I fucking lose? No, I didn't, I didn't, didn't, okay. I got nothing. Okay, then uh, we're gonna go back to Puzzle and uh, show him some love. Alright, and then I will see you guys in uh, 20 hours for the... Co wait, 20 hours? 19 hours for the collab with Kiaren. So, uh, have, a, have a good weekend, and I'll see you guys later.